welcome. Hello. Hello. Welcome to The View. I've been wearing this dress every day this week. Not the same dress. It feels like the same dress. It this feels like looks, the air looks... is coming into the same place it felt like yesterday, and it's not getting any better, and I'm done well, today. This looks very comfortable. It's nice. It's very blousey. Do you, how are yeah. you feeling that with the leggings? It's you look DKNY, good. It's DKNY, $160. Can you stand if you're wondering. Can you stand up in this This, this dress right well, here. Good, I'm going to give it to you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you can, no, you can. I see it's potential. A lot. You've been a good sport, though. I have to yes, congratulate you, you. On, on sticking to your word. I like well, that. I thought it would be, you know, I thought I, if I just showed you that I could do it for a week. <laughs> yeah. I never said I wasn't going to bitch about it, right. but I just yeah, showed, I showed you that I could do it. But, Has you it know, changed you in any way? Emotionally, I mean. Oh, yes. <laughs> I, I find it much more weepy <laughs> than I was, and I'm like chill in places I didn't know I could be chilly in. <laughs> no, it hasn't changed me. I, I, you know, I appreciate people who wear dresses. I appreciate dresses. I know there are times when they are required, but yeah. here now in this day and age, this is not the place where I'm required. So this is my do for the year. This is your send off. <laughs> this is it for this the year. It. And speaking of uh, things for the year, tonight Barack Obama and John McCain mm -hmm. go head to head in the first presidential debate at the University of Mississippi. Now the focus will be on foreign policy and national security. Any uh, predictions? I'm just so excited to finally see a yeah. debate and not the ads and the this and yeah. that. I want to see the right. issues yeah. and what they're going to talk about. I'm so excited. This is where the real information will come out. I think everybody's just hungry for it because I think everyone has what I think I have a rare and acute case of electionitis right now. And everybody's sick and tired of that You're same sick old. Of it? I'm not. I no, love I'm it. Not, not sick of the election, sick of not hearing straight from the candidates, oh. what what they're going to do, what they think about. I think the foreign policy debate is going to be excellent. I think I think John McCain will do quite well. Um, I'm sure Barack Obama will will hang in there too. But you know the, their experiences. Uh, well, McCain seems different. to be really when he when he starts to, in the other debates. I, I I saw he seemed kind of strong when he talked about the foreign policy and he brought in his POW experience in a lot. So I'm, Bill Clinton I'm was here this week and he said. And, you know, I, we, we had a blast with him, President Clinton. He said, I like John McCain. Had it not been for John McCain, I'm not sure I could have normalized relations with Vietnam. And I think when it comes to foreign policy, I think everyone knows that that it will be a huge strength of Senator McCain. So it'll be a good night. Be, I don't know if it'll be a huge strength of his. I, I know that he has some foreign policy experience. They all have some foreign policy experience, well, but nobody has. No, they have all met with the... <laughs> This week now, everybody has met with all the foreign dignitaries. Even if it's just for five yeah, minutes. But I'm Even saying if it's that a field it trip, like, Barack, I mean, honestly, you can't say you Barack Obama what? has experience. I, he took a field well, trip over what? through a free I, concert in Germany. It was an experience. Well, actually, it's more experience than Sarah Palin had. She's not running for the president. She She's not running for the president. But, so, okay, so but, but, but basically, basically you see what? But here's why people are sick of this is because you can't make a statement that says, you know, neither one of these guys have the kind of experience that a presidential person, someone who's been president, will have. None of them had they it. Haven't been Bill president Clinton. yet. But that's my point. Sure. That's what I'm saying. So instead of going head to head about who's got this and who's got that, the point simply is, as Bill said, look, Bill. <laughs> as Bill he's our said, friend now. Yes, he's. Bill, Bill, he's a man. We could get him if we can. Um, but his point is, is what something I've been saying for, for a long time, is that no one is ready for this job. It is a job that you, you know, people say, oh, you can't learn it. You have to learn it.